Hello everybody, today we uh, do the MDS classic analysis uh, on Jamovi. So this is the Jamovi screen and we open the file which we want to use. Click browse and I have it ready here. I will click this study. And this data is about smartphone and Android users and trying to understand them better through uh, their uh, personalities and other factors like gender and age. So you go to MDS tutorial and we click MDS classic analysis. On the left we have the analysis screen, on the right we have the results section where the data will start getting uh, tabulated and you'll have the plot as in when you select the variables on the left. So I would start uh, by explaining the boxes here. On the left we have all the variables in the data. On the right are the selected variables that we want to study the data on and if at all there are some texts which we want uh, to be exhibited in the plot we would add that particular um, uh, variable here. Uh, this is to add color uh, based upon a variable and this is again uh, size based upon another variable which we want to use. The number of dimensions is defaulted to 2. You could change this to any number you want. A distance measure is Euclidean by default. You could also select Manhattan. And if you want to normalize the variables, you just select normalize variable. We go ahead with our analysis. And to start with, I select three variables. And like you see, the data has started to get tabulated on the results section. And another one, phone the status object and I would like to map the color to gender and I would like to map the size to age and here you have the plot. I would say this plot is well described by two dimensions. You could also play around with the variables here and what we could do is maybe we could study only the personality attributes of the five factor model that is including emotionality too and we'll see how the analysis changes if at all okay this is a bit different from the earlier model this is more uh, centralized rather than uh, shifting towards the left now there is one interesting phenomenon which takes place when you add phone as a status object and you will see that the entire uh, points have shifted down towards the first dimension of the coordinate one. Whereas earlier they were more higher and they were on the left. So you could actually play around and see how this affects. And by using goodness of fit tests like BIC scores, you could find out maybe which dimensions or the number of dimensions that would describe the data best. So as of now, I find that two is sufficient, but we could always do the analysis. So that's it, folks. Uh, hope you enjoy doing your MDS classic analysis and hope you find it useful. Uh, and once you're done, you could just save the file. You could say, Fun MDS. Right? Okay then. See you.